and we've made it to St. Louis, home of really weird pizza. I'm just kidding. It was it was good. Home of the toasted ravioli. Home of strange donuts. Not making fun, that's the name. Home of the gooey butter cake. Home of the horseshoe. Home of Provel cheese. Home of Amico gas station. Home of schnucks. Basically, they're the home of a lot of things. But we wouldn't have been able to do this without our friends from That19 who have a brand new channel called Randomonium. So make sure you guys go subscribe to their channel so you can see all the food we eat in St. Louis. So believe it or not, we've actually never made a donut burger or even tried a donut burger, also known as the Luther Burger, named after Luther Vandross, where this burger was served on an episode of the Boondocks. Somehow those two make sense together. But regardless, we decided to try it ourselves with several attempts, some crazy ingredients, and a variety of methods. I don't know, guys, we might have taken this donut burger idea a little too far. Alright guys, we made it to Strange Donuts. Because we're making donut burgers, we gotta use something strange. So we're gonna get two rainbow ponies, two gooey butter, two cocoa crisps. You know, we were gonna go vegan, but we're not, so... Uh... <laughs> Julia, we're at Schmucks, right? Schmucks. Oh, we don't have a kitchen, so we're gonna have to be very tactful here on how we make these donut burgers. We can really appeal to everyone. It's gluten-free. We didn't get the vegan donuts, so we can't get the gluten-free donuts. You either go all in or you don't go at all. All right, we're not doing the video anymore, guys. They got these. I they only served those at Burger King. So did, time. so did I. Mac and cheese snacks? What? Flaming hot? <laughs> As you see here, we have limited tools to create what we need to create. But today, we're gonna be tackling donut burgers. I spent a lot of time working in like fast food, so I have a very sophisticated palate. Barbie. Yeah, I think it really brings out my uh, Asian eyes. The cool thing though about being Asian, I get to see everything in widescreen. <laughs> This is Provel cheese from St. Louis. It's a uh, cheddar, Swiss, and provolone all kind of mixed together. A donut burger doesn't make sense unless the donut's in the burger, yeah. okay? Yeah. Oh no, I was right. Don't do this at home. It's very unsanitary. And you guys are gonna eat it. Is this the first time you've wrapped meat around a pastry? Um, well, no. Listen, I know what you're thinking. Actually, I don't know what you're thinking. <laughs> all right, ready? You have to grill it like this. Just because you do have the hole. That's not safe at all. It's definitely cooking on the inside though. That's good. And look yeah. at that, it almost looks like a little butthole. Ew. Reminds me of the donuts my grandma used to make. <laughs> they look like buttholes too. <laughs> That's where grandma's meatballs come from. Yeah. Okay. Oh, look at that, it looks like caramelization on that almost. What is that? That's beautiful. That again. Ooh. If you don't finish your dinner, you can't have more donuts. We decided to get gooey butter cake to do the grilled cheese style. It's butter, it's grilled cheese, it's savory. So what we're gonna do is cut it in half. You need finesse for this guy. Yeah. Just, oh. oh. No. Good job. Okay. <laughs> That's really good. Oh, because it's like a cake almost, right? Mm -hmm. Let's see if the French toast works. Oh, beautiful. Is it good? Mmm. What you want? Where's He's right over here. That is the most interesting cheese I've ever seen in my life. Well, that's because it's technically not a cheese. Look at it. Don't hate. This is cultural. That's right. Oh, yeah. Oh. oh. And we present the grilled cheese Luther. <laughs> Let's do this. Are you excited? I'm not mm -mm. really. No, yeah, I'm excited. Yeah. It's sweet and savory and cheesy and it's conflicting. 80-20 beef, cheddar cheese, two Krispy Kreme donuts, and a partridge in a pear tree. <laughs> a partridge in a pear tree. Ready? I'm ready. Oh, let's do this. Here we go. Mm -hmm. Oh, it tastes conflicting. I don't know if I'm about That's it. That's weird, man. <laughs> no. I don't hate it. It tastes like a diaper. <laughs> Maybe yours is different than mine. Mine's a culinary journey of flavor and um, essence of beef. Did you eat more than one bite of that? Yeah, one too. Oh my god, and you swallowed? I think this needs some lettuce and tomato. Pickles, onions? Mm-hmm. Oh, like a Big Mac burger. 
Ooh. Oh. Oh. This is also going to taste like a diaper. This looks pretty legit here. Let's do it. Three, two, one. Mm. It's better. It's better. <laughs> it's better. Mm. It's not bad. When you went before, it's better. So. I understand everything you're saying. Yeah. It's weird how the mac sauce actually tastes okay with it. Yeah, right? Mm. Oh, you got a little of my finger there. <laughs> you guys like this? <laughs> Compared to that one. I can't believe you guys like the Big Mac one. Did weird. you like it? Oh, this is the grilled cheese. No, no, that's mm. weird, man. Grilled cheese. I love cheese. grilled cheese. This actually feels good in my hands. Yeah. That's interesting. Another donut down. Cheers. Oh, yeah. oh, yeah! This one doesn't bother me as much. I know, I'm saying this one's pretty good. I almost want to take another bite. We grilled the side, so it's got yeah. more of like a bread texture. And it's got the Provel cheese. Oh, you like the Provel cheese? Yeah. yeah. Oh, I like the French toast. That French toast on it, though. Yeah. Cheese and sweet. Mm. All right. Okay. What is this? Oh, this is this is the weird one. Yeah, yeah, it's like a Christopher Nolan film starring Leonardo <laughs> DiCaprio. There is a donut inside of that burger. Would you call it a donut? That's how you know it's good, guys. The donut inside the burger is just weirding me out. Oh, I just no. want to eat the meat. I know what the donut's gonna taste like. It tastes like a crispy cream. <laughs> That's like a weird cake, man. Uh-uh, uh-uh. <laughs> no, that's it. No. No, 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 no. No, no. You know what? I know this is missing. Flavor nummies. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Too much Krispy Kreme. Yeah. It's so gross. <laughs> no, it's so disgusting. You know the blood from the meat? It's soaked into the donut. <laughs> so you get like a bloody donut taste. Yeah. The donut on the inside of the burger turned into, I don't know, like a wet sock. It's kind of mushy. <laughs> I was having such a good time. Maybe a donut wrapped in like breakfast sausage. Mm. Or a donut wrapped in bacon. Can we just dive into that? We can dive into that, but I was thinking before we do that. Okay. Paleo fish. <laughs> yeah, I'm no. So, I'm sorry. You can't spit it out. Hey, <laughs> I want to feel it. Did you swallow that? Not yet. You want to? Here's a little napkin. Hey. <laughs> so uh, consensus, that one does not work. Ew, the tartar sauce with the cherry flavor. It didn't pair well. It's still the flavor. The fish. It was an interesting experiment. Now I know that I don't like fish and donuts together. Fish and donuts don't go, guys. Why do they put so much tartar sauce on that? I was having a good day. Is that it? No, we got one more donut and then we're done. There's more? One more. Oh, okay. The breakfast donut. Egg McMuffin. Okay. It's iconic. You yeah. got your steamed egg <laughs> and you got your uh, what the Canadians call bacon. JP, this video is called Donut Burger, not Donut Egg and Ham Sandwich. <laughs> she makes a good point. Yeah. Chocolate and eggs. I don't know. I like all of this. I don't understand what's going on anymore, though. <laughs> <laughs> what the? Nope. Mm -mm. Not at all. Mm -hmm. Mm -mm. <laughs> <laughs> I could eat this all day compared to the last one, though. Yeah. The donut's fantastic. It's really good. It's like plastic. <laughs> <laughs> we have to review what we like the best, right? Okay, so standard Luther, good. Not Gross. Grilled cheese donut yes. with the French toast. Ding, da, ding, ding, ding. That's a winner. Definitely my favorite was the French toast. Okay, it's unanimous. Yeah. The French toast is the best. Yep. And then I think a close second's gotta be that filet fish. <laughs> I think what we need to do is just clean all this up and eat a real burger. What do you think? <laughs> well, I guess that's on the floor now. Let's do it. <laughs> Hey -o. Whoa, I thought I said a real burger. Yeah, it is a real. It's a real gummy burger. Wow, only 120 calories. Um, that's per serving. And there's five <laughs> servings. <laughs> so what's 120 times five? 700 million calories? That's freaking awesome. It's the gummy version of JP's shirt. Oh my god, we can't hang out anytime. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh. Mm -hmm. The bun is my favorite. It's like an orange cream. Mm -hmm. I really want to try this. 
This is really fun. I'm really glad that you guys let us do this and come into your studio. Absolutely. Go to the link in the description. You have to check these guys out. They also helped us out with a bunch of products from Vat19. So if you want any of these awesome burgers, there's gonna be a link for that too. Mm -hmm. I'm so happy that I get to finish with this and not that filet -O fish This is so much better. Fish and donuts don't mix. Nope. But tartar sauce and donuts also don't, don't mix. mix. Yeah. yeah. I love this. It's really good. There's nothing like pretending you're eating something that you're not. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, is this real food versus gummy food? Oh, I titled the video wrong. <laughs> so here's a here's our parting gift for healthy junk food. It's the world's largest gummy bear, which is oh, five pounds of cherry gummy. Wow. This is my baby. 